morning, everybody. Sven Ventures here live from Universal Studios here in Orlando, Florida. As you can see behind me, the big globe. And we are going to have an awesome time today. There's so much to discover. I've not been to this park yet. And so, anyway, we're going to explore. I've got to go get my pass. I've got to find out where to get it uh, so I can scan QR code so I can get my pass uh, virtually. And... Uh, an actual card where I could keep my wallet but after we get that we're just gonna have a great time here at Universal Studios and I'm uh, gonna show you around uh, today is the official day that Mardi Gras has started here in Florida in Orlando at Universal and so we're gonna be checking out some of the merchandise some of the uh, perks of everything so come along with me on Spin Venture Let's go! Good afternoon, everybody, or morning. It's still morning. We have finally made it to Universal Studios, and we are passing by the Betty Boop shop, and Shred 40, unfortunately, is closed for good now. And, but, uh, I don't know what the way it is for me. It's not going to Let it walk. <laughs> Day, but I think we're gonna head right over to uh, Philly. Actually, right now we're just gonna explore the place, see what there is. There's the minion. Hey, now. Walk down the main street. So, again, spend much of your life from the Universal Orlando Resort. Uh, and so far, so good. There is a concert tonight. Uh, Sugar Ray is in concert. And what we're gonna do is, I'm actually, we're still gonna stay here for that. And as you can see behind me is Rip Ride Rockets. It's behind me. There it goes. There it goes, over there. There it is. Rip Ride Rockets, so, we're really just, Oh, we're walking this way. Wanted to see where we were going. Of course, it is a uh, Mardi Gras. Of course, you can see over here is the map of the different concerts throughout the Mardi Gras season. And we'll ride rocket. Oh my God! So weird. So, anyway, there we go, that is, so I just had to get through here, we, we are going right in front of the Monsters Cafe, here, you can see the Monsters Cafe is beside me over here, and a lot of, what's this, what's this? I think I'm just going to snack. I want to get, I want to go find the Hot Wheels Express and I want to ride it over to, uh, to, uh, um, what's this? Yeah, ro roasted, rotisserie chicken. Barbecue roasted jackfruit salad, vegan jackfruit sandwich and barbecue pork sandwich here at the Monsters Cafe. <laughs> So as you can see, a lot of hot, hot, uh, hot uh, Harry Potter fans are here. I was seeing them as we were walking in, walking into the main entrance. Right here. And like I said, uh, New Orleans, New Orleans has invaded Orlando, <laughs> and the Mardi Gras has at the. Uh, Mardi Gras celebration here. There you can see inside. There's the king, king cake. Of course, you got chips on a stick. And there's the beignets. And the beignets. Let's see, it's sweet fried pastry with powdered sugar. Yeah, pretty much. You're basically eating a spoonful of sugar. So, but uh, and then we'll come back for those. Right now, we 
are going to head into the Park Place Holiday Shop. Right in front. You can see the Mr. Joker there. The Joker. Or, well, not the Joker, the Jester, the Court Jester. Jester. There, but we're going to walk right into the Holiday Shop here at Universal. There is the scene in the hallway. Here. A lot of uh, Hufflepuff. Hall, uh, Harry Potter. So I guess here. Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ray, Ravenclaw, and Hufflepuff. All different names. Here. Here's a Gryffindor logo. Hogwarts Express. Yes, they do. There it is. It's a stocking hanger of the Hogwarts Express. And a really nice oh my, the Hogwarts Railway coffee mug. <laughs> Good collector's item. What a price on this? Uh, $17, exactly. What is it? Universal prices are very are very cheap compared to Disney. A lot cheaper. And they do have some over there. Oh, oh yeah. The red stripe from Harry himself. The star. Oh, Earl the Squirrel, that's his name. Earl the Squirrel. It just came up. With it. You got the chocolate marsh, you got the studio's chocolate ink horns here. And the Harry Potter world. The Wizarding World of Harry Potter. But first, let's take a look at these huge mummies heads of Mardi Gras. Let's see that purple and gold leaves, green ivy. And the faces there. Kind of frightening. Kind of frightening, but. Anyway. There. Of course, all of the, all of the beds, all of the stands, all the beverage stands, and um, items purchased have a QR code that you can just scan with your phone, and you, it's a virtual queue, so you you will be able to um, you'll be able to book order. So. Let's head this way. Let's head this way. Down to. Uh, looks like we have a show already. You tell me when and where, baby. Let's go ahead and pull the map. Give it up one more time for your singing singers. Up here, and then we'll once we arrive at 
Wizarding World of Harry Potter, we will go ahead and hop on the Hogwarts Express and go back over to Islands of Adventure. So, and, uh, ah, pigeons. Oh dear. Okay, bye, pigeons. Alright, we're gonna stop the video here and make our way to Harry Potter World. Okay, so we are now in Hogsmeade. And yeah, I'm not I'm not in Florida anymore. There it is, Butterbeer, dead ahead. And Hogsmeade is packed. Oh, that's the, that's the train, let's get on the train. It is a 75 minute wait for Hagrid's motorbike adventure. Oh my word. Hour and a half. Like, yeah. Yeah. Where? Where? Have a beer? Yeah. No. no, I haven't. I'm gonna get one though. I bet that you looks. Are. That looks uh, uh, really good. I had. I had one the other day. They were delicious. Are they good? Yeah. Which one's your favorite? They have a hot one and a cold one. Well, I don't know. I had a frozen one. Okay. I'm not having that one because it's too cold. I think right. for me. Where is the line? Oh my heavens. A fast pass for Butterbeer. Looks like the line ends right here, so... Thank you. I'm gonna wait right here for butter beer. It's gonna be amazing. I'll let y'all know how it tastes. I cannot wait to find out how it how it's gonna also go to three broomsticks, I think. We're gonna go check that place out. Uh, it's got some uh Yes. But anyway, there we go. And so we're in line for the butter beer. I'll let y'all know how it tastes. I, I've heard good things about it. That it's gonna be. It, it's so good. Uh, I'm gonna get the hot butter beer because it is a bit chilly today. But of course, in the future, as summer, as spring and summer roll around, it'll be in the 80s and the 90s. That's when I'll get the frozen butter beer. I've heard that's also very good. Uh, I want to get different opinions and uh, leaving comments down below. Which one do you prefer? Do you prefer? Do you prefer the hot butter beer, even though it's warm outside or cold, or the cold butter beer, whether it is cold outside? So let me know down in the comments below. Which one? Which one is your favorite? Let's get some butter beer. We have almost made it to the Who's crying hello. Bye everyone. Have a good time. There it goes. Okay. And we're coming in. One. Okay. I have been paused. 
Open. Oh, sorry. Oh, my God. Line in. Oh, there we go. Okay. We are on the way. Oh, it is reload. Alright, so moments away from departing our station, I think we're going to head into the big tent. It's our first stop. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Good. So, that's a good idea. And we have arrived. We're taking off. We are now departing the station. Yeah, this is an honest adventure. All aboard, everybody! Gather all around! This is the special Whoa, train that really? copies any sound. It's the Echo Maniacal, super reliable, sound like all day and night audio Matic Express. It can move oh, like a cow! It can go move, 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 move! The travel train can do it. Hey, how about you? Hello, everybody down there! <laughs> Can you sound like a circus organ? <laughs> the trolley train can... How about you? Can you go... Boom, 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 bo
uh, the best. Cheryl, be careful. Not the best uh, wait time. It was a 65 minute wait. But, but I only waited 35 minutes for literally a three minute ride. It was not that long at all. It was so short. Um, probably not going to ride that one again. But I am going to try to find another bathroom. So, bathroom, then food. On the next spin venture. Good evening, everybody. Spin Ventures here live from Universal Orlando, Florida. We are in we are in Simpson Land, Simpsons World, and here they have a, just a bunch of arcade games. They do have the Simpsons ride that's behind me. They also have the. Uh, hey. They also have. They also have. Uh, snacks and sta drink stands available. Right now, we're going to go ahead and head on in. We're going to go wait. It's a 30 minute wait for the Simpsons ride. So I'll show you guys. And we're going to go ahead and ride on in. A 30 minute wait. Probably a 30 minute wait, so we're going to walk right on in. Rusty land. Um, okay. We got the Simpsons on. Mm -hmm. up y'all oh. Oh. oh no oh. oh no I should have did it off my hat dang it oh, I'm out. oh my god I'm definitely like a company here. I don't think I'll get a copy mug. I think I'm gonna get 
yet. Just like one of the, like a souvenir. Oh, that sounds fun. Know your sponge. Serious, excited. Sponge. Oh, put on a half of them. They're all like kid shirts. I really like that Roosevelt shirt. to my car after a long walk from Universal Studios to the parking garage up about four flights of escalators to the top floor in the Spider-Man parking lot. Finally made it. Thank you guys so much for joining me here. I took a lot of pictures, a lot of videos. My phone's about to die and my camera's about dead. So shows you how much I filmed and documented. Of course, I will be making the video tomorrow, putting it all together and everything to where things should go. But uh, overall, so much fun. I cannot wait to come back, have a weekend where it's not 50 degrees and it was 84 yesterday. I wish I'd have came yesterday, but because it was like 82 degrees, it was nice, it was gorgeous, and very warm. But, anyway, uh, Mardi Gras hit it off with a big bang. I got the last float, uh, recorded and documented, I'll put that in the video as well. 
as I make this universal video. But uh, overall, great time. Had two. I had uh, two cups of butter beer today, <laughs> and uh, it was very good. I love it. So good. Uh, enjoyed the Harry Potter world, uh, Wizarding, Wizarding World of Harry Potter. There were still some stores that I was not able to go into. There was a lot of stuff that I was not actually able to see. Um, but I did ride a few rides. Uh, I was able to ride Despicable Me, the Transformers, uh, Jimmy Fallon's Race Through New York, and King Kong, uh... I think I rode, um, oh, a Woody Woodpeck, uh, roller coaster, but, uh, still a lot of rides I did not get to ride, uh, or characters I didn't get to see, uh, but like I said, I will be back, I got my annual pass, I will be able to come back whenever I can, uh, and, uh, basically whenever I want to, on the weekends, so, uh, other than that, overall fun day. Thank you guys so much, and we'll see you all on the next Spin Venture. Good night.